Good morning, everyone. We're so happy you're here with us today, whether it's here in person or online. We're just glad you're joining us. We're going to continue with our Worship and Wonder series this morning. We are going to talk about the 10 best ways to live. This is the desert box. Inside is just a small piece of the desert. Bless you. Thank you. <laughs> so many important things happen in the desert that we just need a little small piece of it with us so we can tell our stories. The desert is a strange and wild place. At night, it's very, very cold. Brr. And in the daytime, it's psh, burning hot. Oh, my goodness. And there is almost no water at all. The desert is always changing. The wind comes, and it, as it blows, it shapes and molds. So the desert is never the same. Now, after God let the people go through the water to freedom. They were free to go anywhere they wanted. Anywhere. Oops. But what was the best way to go? Well, God loved the people so much that he said to Moses, I will show you the way. I will lead you to the holy mountain, Mount Sinai. Now, when they got close to the holy mountain, they could see fire and smoke, and they were afraid to even come close. But Moses, Moses went close. He climbed up the holy mountain. <clears throat> and he stayed there talking with God. And God told Moses the 10 best ways to live. When Moses came down from the holy mountain, he gave the 10 west best ways to live to all the people. There were four best ways for loving God. And there were six best ways for loving people. The 10 best ways to live are so important. We call them the law. You might also heard them being called the 10 commandments. <clears throat> we add this other piece so that we can remember why God gave us the law. It says God loves you. Would you like to know what the 10 best ways to live are that God gave to Moses? I can show you. The first are the best ways for loving God. Number one is At the very beginning, God said, I am the one true God. This is very important. Everything depends on this. So the first commandment is, do not serve other gods. The second is, make no idols to serve. The third is, I am God. So don't take my name lightly. And the fourth, keep the Sabbath holy. 
to rest and remember the gifts of creation. And the best ways to love people honor your father and your mother. Do not kill. Do not break your marriage. Do not steal. Do not lie. And do not want what others have. This is the law. And it's hard. It's very hard to do what it says all the time. But God loves us and shows us the way to be the best people that we can be. I wonder which one of these would be most important to you. Hmm. Let's say a prayer. Hands together in our laps, heads down. Dear God, Dear God thank you for giving us the law. Thank you for giving us the law. Help us to follow it always. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus name we pray. Amen.